Somebody shout hallelujah. If you have come here to meet the only sovereign God, the only true and living God, the only God who answers prayers, the only unlimited God, I want you to shout a louder hallelujah. Father, I want to thank you tonight. Amen. It has pleased you to bring us together from our various places, homes, towns, and cities. Lord, we give you all the glory in the name of Jesus. Amen. You have brought us here to bless us. You have, blessed us, you have brought us here to impart our lives, to do what eyes have not seen. To do what ears have not heard. To do miracles that have not been settled in the heart of men. Father, I pray, O oh God, you will manifest your presence in our midst throughout this rally in the name of Jesus. Amen. You will touch everyone on this campground. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, blessed God. Thank you, Lord. Minister to us. Amen. Impart our lives. Amen. The Bible says, where the word of the king is, there is power. Yes, Lord. Let your power be demonstrated. Amen. Heal the sick tonight. Amen. Save the sinner tonight. Amen. Deliver the oppressed tonight. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Do what eyes have not seen. Amen. Do what ears have not heard. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, blessed Thank God. You, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Amen. I greet uh, Mommy Jill. The Lord will increase your grace in the name of Jesus. I also greet our daddy in the Lord, our daddy Gio. The Lord will continue to add your blessings in Jesus' name. Thank you. All the leaders of the FWI, the only international group in First Square Church. Our national president. We want to thank you for the opportunity given to us, Ikorodu to host this convention, women's convention. I pray that your shadow will never grow less. In the name of Jesus. Amen. The Lord will increase you on every side. Amen. A little you do shall turn to thousands. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Our Axis President, Nomi Clement, we want to rejoice with you. This program is a success already. And I pray that on Saturday your joy shall be fuller. In Jesus name. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Our God is here tonight. And is the sovereign God. Is the ultimate in power. When we say our God is sovereign, what we are saying is this. Is ultimate and supreme in power and authority. There is no one like him. It is above every Every creature. Oh God, you go and share that is a self-existent God. God who has no limit. And it's a need you want. In the name of Jesus. I pray in your life. These days. As you attend this convention. The power of God will demonstrate that in your life. In the name of Jesus. Sovereign God. He reigns in heaven. And he rules on us. Glory be to God in heaven. There is nothing this our God cannot do. There is no sickness he cannot heal. He performs miracles that are beyond the comprehension of man. And that is why I want to beseech you. 
these days, as you remain in camp, let your expectation be high. Let your expectation be high. You have come to meet a God who can do all things. Hallelujah. It will meet you at the point of your needs. Much more than you even expect that God will do for you. In the name of Jesus, I've been asked to zero in on the Lord, the sovereign God, who inhabits the praises of his people. God, who reigns in heaven, but inhabit the praises of his people. We have that in Psalm 22. Verse 3. The Bible tells us. And I farm so every one of us that our God, the sovereign God, the Bible says, But thou art holy. O thou that inhabited the praises of Israel. Inhabits. Wherever people are gathered together. To praise this sovereign God. God leaves heaven. Comes down into their midst. And begins to do the miraculous. Glory be to God. By the power of the living God. As we praise him these days. That God will demonstrate his power in your life. In the name of Jesus. Sovereign God. Who inhabits the praises of his people. That has been his habit. It is his natural habit. To leave heaven. Where a host of angels praise him. And come down to earth. Where men and women gather together to praise him. God did it in the Garden of Eden. He left heaven. He visited Adam in the, in the Garden. In Exodus chapter 3, God called Moses and told him that Moses, I have seen the affliction of my people. I have seen the terror that Pharaoh exposed them to. And he told Moses, I am coming down these four days. These four days, God is visiting Ajebo. Is coming to visit us. In fact, he's here with us now. He told Moses, he told Moses, he told Moses, Moses I am coming down to deliver my people to save them from the hands of Pharaoh. I pray for somebody under this my voice. This day, God will visit you. He will visit you in your cabins, in your rooms, as you walk on the street of Ajebo camp. You will see the glory of God in the name of Jesus. When the children of Israel, when they left, when they left Egypt, God visited them with the Shekinah glory, the pillar of cloud, the pillar of cloud and fire, what they had never seen before. And that is why I tell somebody, First Corinthians chapter two. Nine, the Bible says, eyes have not seen, ears have not heard, neither has it entered into the heart of man what God has prepared for those who love him. Before you came here today, no matter when you came, God has prepared for you what eyes have not seen, 
what ears have not heard. Miracles that men have never seen before. When God says, I will do a new thing, He meant what He said. To so explain it to us, that what eyes have not seen, miracles you have never experienced before. You have not seen it. You have not heard it. Ah, it's what does not enter into the heart of men. You will experience this time. This year, 2023, yeah, June rally, you will experience it in the name of Jesus. What eyes have not seen, I want you to say after me, miracles, eyes have not seen, ears have not heard, that have not entered to the heart of men. This year, June rally, I will experience it. I will express it. So shall it be. In the name of Jesus. Yes, in Second Chronicles, chapter 20, from verse 20, the children of Israel, they had a challenge in their country. An enemy invaded them. From five countries invaded them. And God sent a messenger to them. This battle is not your own battle. I will fight for you. I tell somebody here tonight, whatever battle you may be passing through, be sovereign God who never loses a battle. He will fight for you. It's a faithful God. It's a faithful God. I say he will fight for you. So he told them, this battle is not your own. I will fight for you. So he sent a message to them. God has sent me to you tonight to affirm to you, to echo it to you. The battle you are passing through, the sovereign God said, he will fight for you. I want you to affirm it to yourself. Sovereign God, you will fight for me. So shall it be in the name of Jesus. How are they to fight that battle? God told them, go and get your choristers, your orchestra, your song leaders. Oh, one thing I like for square for is this. God has blessed us with good song leaders. Somebody has said, when we get to heaven, David will be the master song leader. And the first queran will be the assistant. Glory be to God in the highest. Go and get your choristers and your choristers and begin to sing praises to me. Begin to sing praises in the battle, in the battlefield. No weapon of war. But just take your tambourine. Your violin. Your trumpet. Your bass to bass. Begin to blow them. And in very clear language. Begin to sing. Praises unto the sovereign God. And they continue to do that. They started doing that. Within a minute. The Bible says. God set an ambush against their enemy. They confused their language and they began to fight themselves. Before you get home, whatever enemy that may be waiting for you, God will confuse their language in the name of Jesus. My counsel for you tonight because the Bible says enter his gate with thanksgiving and enter into his court with praises. Praises does not only give you access to the court of God when you engage in praising God. 
morning. You invite God into the presence. Your presence. So praise God. Praise God. Develop an attitude of praising God. So my counsel for you give to God quality praise. Quality praise. Quality praise. Everybody shout, give to God. Quality praise. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. In Luke 11, one of the disciples of Jesus met him as a Lord. Teach us how to pray. Teach us how to pray. As John taught his disciples. As John taught his disciples. Your prayer today is this. Say, Lord, teach me how to give you quality praise. God delights so much in quality. What do I mean by quality places? There are five characteristics of, quali of quality places. How many characteristics? Five. Five. Oh, you are very good students. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Giving God quality praises. One characteristic of quality praises is that you must give to God praises willingly. Willingly. You must grow to a level where it at every time in all situation you give praise to God it flows from your heart in Isaiah chapter 1 verse 19 the Bible says if you be willing if you be willing and obedient you will eat the good of the land so we eat the good of oh, the land. No. So give quality praises. Every moment. Give quality praises. Let it come out of your willingly. Number two characteristic. You give quality praises. Cheerfully. The Bible says God loves a cheerful giver. Not only your substances. But each time you are praising God. Praise God cheerfully. Praising with seal. Praising employing every part of your life. Dance before him. Sing unto him. Do it cheerfully. Oh, glory be to God. God loves a cheerful giver. Number three characteristics. You give praises with a pure heart. Pure heart. Psalm 24. Verse 3. To 5. The Bible says. Who shall stand into the holy of God. He that has clean hands. And a pure heart. Quality presence. Is given to God. With a pure heart. The praises of a sinner. Is an abomination. Abomination oh, unto God. Okay. So you are here tonight. I have a conviction that you are living in sin. Your praises, your dancing is just an entertainment. If you want your praises, you want your praises to ascend unto God. You must give your praises with a pure heart. Clean hands. And thank God for Jesus. He made provision for us to cleanse us from every 
kind of sin. I pray for somebody here tonight. Before we begin to pray, if you are here and you have that conviction in your heart that you are still living in sin, you need to repent of that sin. You cannot cover your sin with dancing. You can't do it. Because everything is open unto him. The Bible says, He that covered it in sin shall not prosper. Why that confesses it and forsake it will receive mercy. God still inhabit the praises of his people. You want God to descend into your praises? You must praise him with a pure heart. Number four characteristic. You praise God with faith. The Bible talks about the prayer of faith. You praise God in faith. From verse 5, because thou shalt love the Lord with all your heart. Thou shalt love the Lord thy God with all your heart. Praise the Lord. God wants you. Each time you are praising him, you employ the whole of your heart. Not just the outward appearance. Let it come from your heart. There was a story sometime. One of our fathers in the Lord told us over, over 40 years ago. There was a young man. He decided in a particular year. He decided. This year. When you are doing I will go to church several times. I will make my church services. I will to count the number of times I will go to church. From January to December. So what did he do? He got a bag. I hung it in one corner of his room. Any day he went to church, he will get a stone and throw it in that bag. He did it meticulously and religiously. Any day he went to church, he will never miss dropping a stone there. The last day of the year, he said, I'm going to carry the bag. And count the number of stones. Oh, so that I will know the number of times but I went to church. It was expecting a very heavy bag. Oh, no, it back, oh, you know, to his amazement. So, to his amazement. See, when he brought down the bag. So, back, oh, so, he only met a stone there. Oh, back, oh, so, Just one. Hey, oh, so, what happened? Kilo, so, Who came here? Talo, while he was showing his surprises, he heard the voice of an angel. You went to church several times. It was only one day you oh, went with your heart. You went with your heart. There are many people who are in the church. But they have traveled fast. Quality praise comes from the heart. I pray for somebody here today. As you praise God, the Lord will arrest your heart. In the name of Jesus. Two things we do when we praise God. Teach us to give you quality praise. Two things we do in praises. Two things we do when we praise God. Number one, you remind God whom he is. He has not forgotten himself. But you tell him what you know about him. I ask you tonight, what do you know about your God? What are his virtues? What are his qualifications? What are the characteristics of your God? The level of your knowledge of God will determine the level that you praise him. Oh, you tell him who he is. Oh, God. 
You are sovereign. You are holy. You are righteous. You are limited. Oh, you are faithful. Oh, glory be to God in highest. Every good thing you know about God. You have no limit. You are the self-existent God. You are the same yesterday, today, and forever. You are the unchangeable God. The unchangeable change in the situation. That is God. You are glorious. You are great. Oh, you are gracious. That is your God. You tell him who he is. The second thing you do in place you remind him, you tell you in very clear language. Very clear and understandable language. Very loudly. To lift up the voice of God. What you know God has done. What he has done. What the Bible tells us he has done. He created the heavens and the earth. With the authority of his word. Oh, that is God for you. He didn't have to make any struggle to create things. He just spoke. He just spoke. And things came into existence. Remind him what he did in the life of Isaac. How he blessed him. How he gave Daniel an excellent spirit. How he gave him wisdom. How God fell the wall of Jericho. Tell him what he did. And you also tell him. Those things you are expecting. Him to do. Great things. Job said. Unto God will I bring my cause. Who doeth great things. Marvelous things. Without number. I pray for somebody here tonight. The grace to give God quality praise. Receive in the name of Jesus. Can you rise to your feet? Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. This is how we're going to start this today. We have been doing it. We have been praising God. But do it more. I encourage you. Do it more. Because God inhabits the praises of his people. He dwells in the midst of his people when they praise him. As you rise to your feet, we're going to sing a thousand songs. A thousand praises. How do we do it? Do we lift up your voice? Make sure the voice of the person by your side does not overshadow you. You will sing one of your favorite songs. One of the songs you love to praise God with. In very clear language. And you raise your voice. You will sing that song. Make sure you are not singing the song of the person by your side. Sing from your heart. Lift up your voice. Now. Let's sing a thousand songs. 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 It's worthy. Sing a thousand songs. Let it be qualitative. Let it come from your heart. Don't copy the person by your side. Oh, yes. Oh, babo kado serebo kababa sheba baba. Hallelujah. Oh, 
I come to thee. Oh Lord, who is like unto thee? Oh Lord, among the gods, who is like thee? Glorious in holiness and fearful in praise. Though he wonders, hallelujah. Motin Roba was just a pair. Motin Ritoya, not a jay. Iroba be Jesu, Comasio. Oh, Nicola, but I hear Robby Agogo. I battle on a ball. I battle on a ball. Oh, Lano, sorry, oh, what did Jericho? Glory, 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 glory. You can change your gear. You can sing another song. It's worthy. It's worthy. A thousand songs. You can change gear now. God inhabit the praises of his people. He dwells in the midst of his people. The praises of his people. Oh yes, that's God for you. is part of praising God with all our eyes closed. One of the qualities of praises, good quality praises is praising God with a pure heart. I'm not doubting the fact that you have been a Christian for years. First John 3 8, the Bible says, He who commits sin belongs to the devil. And For the devil sinned from the beginning. Are you here today? The praises of a sinner are still abomination unto God. I don't want you to miss the miracles of God. In this women's convention. So I want you, if you are here, to have a conviction in your heart that you are still living in sin. God does not listen to the prayers of the sinner. And the Holy Spirit is convincing you no matter how little, small that sin is, God hates sin in all. You commit sin to the And you are here. You have you cannot help yourself. There is a God here today. The sovereign God. He wants to help you. Come unto me. Uh, I keep All you that labor. And I have I will give you. Oh, yeah, so you will know the truth. Oh, and the truth will set you free. God wants to set you free. Oh, today. So if you are there. Oh, I want you to raise your right hand. I want to pray. With you. Okay. 
raise your right hand up and put it on your chest and pray this prayer with me. Say, Lord, I thank you for bringing me to this camp meeting. I can see and identify some sins in my life. I want to be free from the hand of the devil. So Lord, I confess. And ask God, please help me not to go back to those sins again. Oh yes. Give me power. Not to go back to sin again. Tonight, write my name in the book of life. Thank you for doing that. Hallelujah. If you pray that prayer sincerely with me, I would like to pray with you. I can only do that if I know you. Just come nearer me. I want to pray with you. Wherever you need it. I want to come quickly. Just quickly. Lord help me. I want to be free totally. So that my praises can ascend unto you. The king's business requires haste. You have to come quickly. And go on your knees. Whatever that sin is, begin to confess them to God. Begin to confess them. Run here if you are coming to join us. I will soon be praying now. And our mommy Gio will pray for you. Just mention those things. I did this many years ago. And they never came back again. Because God gave me the power. To overcome sin. Say, who commits sin belongs to the devil? For the devil is sinner from the beginning. This rally is meant for you. The greatest blessing a man can ever have is salvation from sin. Freedom from sin. You are coming, please, run quickly. Run quickly. Come and join them. Confess those sins to God. Mention them to God. Lord, I've tried to get myself free. I couldn't do it. So, Lord, please help me. Give me power. Not to go back to them again. You can be sure heaven is rejoicing because of what you are doing. Quality praises. Is given with pure hearts. Hands that are clean. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Let me invite our mommy Gio to come and pray for them. I believe you're already praying. You are talking to God. You are encountering God right now. Don't be ashamed. Whatsoever may be the sin, he said it in his word. He will wash you clean. And you will be as bright as snow. The Lord is working upon you right now. This is the foundation of everything. To give your life to Christ. To repent of your sin. Whosoever comes to him, he will not cast out. Congratulations. I am congratulating you. This is the foundation of everything. Because the heaven is rejoicing over anyone that returns to Christ. The heavens they are jubilating on your behalf. Don't be ashamed. Tell it to Christ. The blood of Jesus is flowing. The blood of Jesus that can never lose its power. He's cleansing you. He's wiping them away. He's throwing them to the sea of forgetfulness. And they will never fish it out. 
Jesus. I want you to pray along to, to with me. Say, Lord Jesus, I surrender my life unto you. Lord Jesus, I know I cannot do it by myself. I receive grace to live a life that is pleasing unto you. I thank you, Lord Jesus, that you have root out all the sin. You have taken all the sins away. You have removed the garment of filthiness. And you have put upon me the garment of righteousness. That throughout the days of my life, I will live to please you. Thank you, Jesus, for redeeming me with the blood of your son. Father in heaven, we thank you. We bless your holy name. This is great. This is a good start. Father, thank you for this one that have come unto you the way they are. And they have asked for forgiveness. Father God, I plead with you. Bless them totally. Amen. Father God, connect them to yourself. Amen. In the mighty name of Amen. Jesus. They will never go back to their vomit Amen. again. You have cleansed them inside and outside. Amen. By the salvation of their soul today, their root has changed. Amen. Because you said, if any man be in Christ Jesus, it's a new creation. All things are passed away. Behold, everything has become new. I declare concerning these people that are kneeling down before you, they become new. Brand new. And you will help them to live a life that is pleasing unto you. They will never go back. Amen. The blood of Jesus, blood of Jesus. has cleansed them. Amen. And they have parts in the heavenly kingdom. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. We bless your holy Hallelujah. name. Father, we thank you. Thank you Jesus. Even for our daddy that has ministered unto us this evening. Father God, we pray you will reveal him back. Amen. Your hand will rest upon him mightily. Amen. Father God, a lot has gone out of him. You will refill Amen. him back. More unction to function. Amen. Fresh anointing every Amen. time. In the name of Amen. Jesus. And it shall be well with Amen. him. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, we bless your holy Hallelujah. name for this new beginning. Amen. For this one. Amen. Thank you, mighty Thank Savior. You, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Please. You will not go. This is a new beginning. Some people are around to cancel you the more and to pray with you. And all your desire that you came here with shall turn to testimony. But your salvation is the beginning of your testimony. God bless you. God bless you, Jesus.